Season five has been out for a week, which is kind of crazy to me. I don't know if it feels like it's been, you know, a long time since it's come out or a short time. Time just doesn't feel real. And with that, a ton of new concepts have come out from the Forge community with the addition of Campaign AI. In this video, I want to go over some of the more enjoyable creations I have found and played, you know, seen from Twitter and stuff like that. And these range from Firefight to more linear campaign missions. And I'm going to kind of group them up. We're going to do Firefight first and then the campaign missions for the second half of the video. The links to the creations will be in the description as well as the game modes for those maps as well. Remember, you kind of have to search for the game modes in the custom, you know, game settings because you can't just click them right now. I hope 343 fixes that. But yeah, we have Halo 2, Star Wars, and more in this video, and I plan to showcase and spotlight future creations. So make sure you subscribe. I know 90-some percent of you who watch the videos aren't subscribed, but you watch them anyway, so just go ahead and, and hit that sub button. We're grinding away to 15,000 subs, and I would greatly appreciate it. I love Halo, and if you love Halo, this is the right place for you. Now, first up, we have the extremely talented team of Cousin Tim, Infinite Forges, and a whole host of others. Refuge is the name of the map. While other modes can be played on this map, I really feel like Firefight kind of shines in this beautiful creation. These folks are really erasing the line between dev quality and user-generated content. Now, keep in mind, I do play on low settings on my PC, so it probably looks even better. All these maps are going to look even better if you play on higher settings. But I absolutely love this map. I think it's gorgeous. Definitely worth a bookmark. And if you see it in the custom games browser, I definitely think you should hop in. I'm playing by myself, so I'm definitely dying and stuff. I'm no PvE lord, as you will see throughout the video. But this would be absolutely a blast to play with, you know, a couple friends. Next up, we have another firefight map. But this time, it's on the Halo 2 campaign level outskirts. The three credited creators are Jujitsu X... Squishy OP9, I hope I said your name right, and Twison with a lot of T's. Again, I'm sorry if I butchered your names. But if you're a fan of Halo 2, obviously you're going to enjoy this firefight styled remix from that campaign. We're now going to move on to the Star Wars theme map of this episode, and it is a Star Destroyer, kind of Venator class. I'm not saying that I'm a Star Wars expert or anything. But we're going to be taking on waves of enemies in Firefight. This one has a ton of credits for those who helped, but I believe the main owner is GG Heo7. And honestly, this map is something that I've wanted to see from a Star Wars game for years, so it's kind of crazy that Halo has it before Star Wars does. They are really dropping the ball in terms of like Star Wars games. I just don't know what they're doing. But yeah, I love Star Wars, and to see it in Halo, that's an A plus from me. I will say that I get absolutely destroyed by myself, so I feel like with a, with a couple of other people, it's a lot of fun. Moving on to the more traditional linear campaign creations, we have The Hunt by Taking Elk 0770 and Epic Miner 06. The description reads, after the UNSC Star Surfer fell under attack by the banished, the Spartan, or Spartans, aboard must escape and rescue as many Marines as possible. One to eight players. I don't want to ruin anything for these you know, creations, uh, because I think that that would be kind of disingenuous to the creators and stuff, so I'm not going to really talk about what's happening in there. I will give the descriptions because they gave them, but this was really fun. Next up, we have Human Guy Man and Uncle Kizo, who have created Recompense, I think is how you say that, a campaign-style mission where you need to burn a hole through the covenant-infested Arcadian jungles to secure an Oni research facility, one to six players. What a cool description for uh, a map. I love that. Anything with Oni in it, definitely give this one a shot. Last but not least, we have Madman Epic, who has created Inclemency. Where are you guys getting these names from? Another campaign-style creation where you are stranded in a frigid wasteland, assault a banished excavation site to earn your escape. I love snow maps. I'm so happy that they have, like, snow assets and the snow forge canvas now. Cannot wait to see what we get out of that. But this one was a lot of fun, and it kicked my butt. I was not prepared. I feel like some of these missions are harder than the campaign levels. So it's pretty wild, you know, what the community has come up with in such a short amount of time. And as we go on, I expect some really crazy things to come from this. If I'm not mistaken, 343 has confirmed that Forge Creations will be in matchmaking and will be a part of the Firefight release later in the season. Hopefully they add more assets like the Flood. So we can get some horror flood creations going. You can finally get that horror flood game that I've been craving forever. 
But these have just been amazing. So what I'm going to ask from you is if you know of any creations that are really good, you know, even in the future, let me know in the comments down below. I would greatly appreciate it. I definitely want to spotlight some of this. Hopefully the custom games browser is fixed a little bit. It's kind of wonky right now, which stinks. But you can already play Firefight in the custom games browser, so you don't have to technically wait. My next question to you all is, what are you looking forward to? What would you like to see? You guys trying to get some Destiny 2 missions in here? Some Resident Evil stuff? I don't know. A Zelda campaign map thing? Gears of War? Anything is possible at this point. But that's going to do it for the video, ladies and gentlemen. If you enjoyed it, make sure you leave a like down below. It greatly helps out the video and my channel get into that YouTube algorithm. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, and I will catch you around the ring. Peace!